Hello everyone and welcome to another Feed Army video. My name is Emmanuel and today I will announce to you that you can no longer remove yourself from Google Merchant Center Classic or Next if you are a standard user. Now this is quite frustrating for merchants or businesses that have multiple uh, accounts linked to one email address so you now have to actually contact the account owner to be able to remove you as a user so before you could just simply click on your user uh, access and then uh, remove yourself so for example here i have a standard access and you can no longer click on your email however if we go to an account where i'm an admin you can still access it And of course, you can remove yourself now. Here Google has announced the following. Please be advised that user role management within Google Merchant Center Classic and Next is restricted to administrators. While we acknowledge instances where users might have been able to modify roles previously, our current security protocols state that only admins can add, delete or edit user permissions through the user tab. It follows then by saying previous versions of Google Merchant Center, both Next and Classic, may have uh, different account management options. This functionality has potentially been adjusted to strengthen the overall security and privacy measures within the Merchant Center platform. As Google Merchant Center undergoes continuous development, we regularly assess and refine functionalities to ensure alignment with industry best practices and uh, user requirements and then it just goes and uh, explain how you can request a removal either by directly uh, contacting the administrator uh, or through Google if the admin is not uh, responding to you. Now this personally to me uh, is quite uh, annoying because I have a lot of access for lots of different accounts um, so removing yourself is something that I periodically do so that I can recycle my email addresses to be able to keep access. Contacting uh, lots of different uh, merchants after I've uh, finished the task is uh, an extra step that I now have to do to ensure that I can uh, free up my email addresses. Now, what I want to... Uh, talk about a little bit is about the overall security and privacy measures now this is a little bit how should i say silly what what uh, can you uh, have as a standard user that is a security or privacy risk as a standard user you have access to the whole account except to the growth area and except to certain features that uh, relate to the payment sections and google ads uh, connection so from an admin perspective, yes, you don't want to show that to the standard user if they are just as accessing you, your account. However, um, as a standard user, you don't have access to those areas, so there is no security risk. The only thing I could um, uh, think of is that uh, if you have verified and claimed the website through a standard user then that would indeed cause an issue if you remove yourself then the um, verification and uh, approval uh, in google merchant center is lost and you need to reclaim that through another uh, email address so for my for my accounts uh, my clients i always ask the client to do that for themselves so that they don't have that situation where for example if i remove myself that there's uh, a lost claim and verification so from that perspective it's also rather uh, interesting that if if that is the only reason then surely you should just allow only admins to verify and claim the website and not a standard user uh, now that you cannot remove yourself as a standard user is in my opinion uh, not a good step forward but a step backwards in the platform usability uh, if you are also frustrated about this i recommend you send an email to google to send them feedback um, so that they can assess based on the amount of emails they get if uh, they would want to refer back or change how it works in my opinion it's not a good step forward anyways this is today's news uh, this issue has started uh, i think three three weeks to four weeks ago 
uh, Google was, uh, it took me four or five emails to get uh, them to finally come to the conclusion that indeed you cannot remove yourself because they gave me a lots of steps like, oh, you, yes, you can still remove yourself, um, but they didn't read their own uh, <laughs> documentation, I guess. Uh, anyways, that's it for today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.